Listen, we're, we're not talking about Elden Wrong today. We're playing Demon Souls with the large sword of moon. Why do people interrupt me in video games? Can't they program AI to make it so that they don't talk over me? It's just rude. It's just rude. I'm talking. Ugh. Yes. Bro, I got a full set of armor on. Usually I play as a different kind of character. This is actually pretty sweet. I start with the heater shield and a halberd? Bro, I'm already OP. This is amazing. I chose I chose this character. Oh Jesus. Oh, that's okay. We have realized the flaw in our build. I am hunched over for a reason. That is a pretty sick animation. Oh, and the wrenching sounds? I love wrenching. Love it. Yoink. They can't even program AI to jump over rocks. Hey, look at that. Bloodborne. If you know, you know. Do you guys know? You probably don't know. There we go. Hold on. I, I can't. I got to take off my pants. I got to take off my shield. Oh, my God. Take off my gloves. Oh my god, take off that. Perfect. Whew. Much better. Okay. Much, much better. The armor was it was it was good for a little while, but I it got a little old. Your eyes have been open, that's what I do. <sighs> this game is <laughs> dude, that's actually brutal. That's actually really brutal, and I like it. Oh my god. That is nice. <laughs> Dude! Dude, I'm inside him. Roll reversals! Ooh! Booty slap! Oh my god, what do I do with this guy? Hold on. Dude, this weapon is OP. Damn. You just chop these guys in half. Well, I guess in thirds, technically. Spear straight to the solar plexus from behind. I love the head knock. It's just... Hold on, can I... Yeah, thank you. Like, the, the, the quick knock to the head... It's real good. Real well done. It's just got that speed to it. Emily Snow. With the 34-month resubscription. You know what is nice? Not getting audited and then not getting banned for making pyramids. <laughs> Oink. Spin moves, man. Spin moves for days. Oh, you want to fight? I don't know why he did that. That was definitely not a, a good decision. Got some half moon grass. Oh, I bonked. Can I jump attack in this game? No, it's not even Elden Ring. Damn, I need the jumps. This is gorgeous, though. Absolutely gorgeous. I love all the blood splatter on me, too. Um, we should probably heal. There we go. The PS5 remake looks absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, and the best thing about it are booty jiggle physics. Look at the, the booty jiggles, dude. It literally jiggles. I always highlight the booty jiggling. It's... I think it's the best. I mean, look at that thing. Oh, it's glorious. Oh, that's dangerous. That is real dangerous. Quick roll. <laughs> Give me those cheeks. Oh, God. Ooh, that was close. He's got a lot of different attacks.
I took that on purpose. I, I just I just wanted to see how much damage he would do to me. <laughs> Ooh, look at that little shiny thing on my crotch. That's my thigh. Ashen Throne with the seven month resubscription. Thanks so much, Ashen. Always sub for the booty. Best booty in the business. Other streamers are jealous of my booty. Scream Major with the three month Twitch Prime resubscription. Thanks so much for the three. And Aragorn the Platypus with the KO Ken times five gifted subscription. Hitting me with a sub cannon straight to the solar plexus. You goddamned legend. Thanks for the five gifted subs. Hope you're having a good day, Aragorn. Thank you so much. Yeah, this is the tutorial level. It's always, it's always fun to go through, I think. You get to see this cool cutscene. Zvinka Peppa Jar with the gifted subscription. Thanks for all the subs, guys. Thank you so much. And that's why we do the tutorial. Right there. I love that. Watermelon. Good thing you had the helmet. I might have died, but I prevented a concussion. All right. Nobody wants to hear you talk. I'm in a rush today. All right. Let's purchase some of this stuff. Four. I got four whole ones. Gates of Bulletaria. Go Ouija! With the KO Ken times five gifted subscription. Heading me with another sub cannon straight to the solar plexus, you goddamn legend. Thanks for the five gifted subs. What's going on today, guys? Thank you so much. Boom. All right. I always like coming back here. There's a few. Uh, there's a few herbs. Some late moons. Gray beard dragon with the KO Ken times five gifted subscription, hitting me with another sub cannon straight to the solar plexus. You goddamn legend. Hunter nuts with the back to back. KO Ken times five gifted subscription. Yet another sub cannon straight to the solar plexus. Marcy Yoma with the 666 bits. Blood for the blood god. What is going on here? Thanks, Marcy. Graybeard. Hunter Nuts. Whoopsies. Jeez. You guys are on, uh, you're on something else. Joke. No. We do not do that. No, 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 no. No. Oh, I missed. Yo, this weapon is sick. Most of the time I play the game, I get, like, the Crescent Falchion, and I get the Dragon Bone Spasher. Oh, burned. But this has been cool. I like this weapon. Way back when, on PS3, I used to do PvP, and my offhand weapon was a Mirrodin Hammer. Just in case I went up an, uh, so with someone else who had a Mirrodin Hammer, because that weapon was, was just disgusting in PvP. And, but my real weapon of choice was the Guillotine Axe. And that's a super close range weapon, but if you know how to you just use stamina in this game and how to bait out another player's stamina, you can essentially stun lock them to death in certain situations with a guillotine axe. But the Mirrodin Hammer had a big advantage. Range. Range. 
get burned. I love the, the burn effect in this game. That's where execution of Meralda is. She drops the, the guillotine axe. Excuse me. Hold on. Some stuff back here. That's a real good run attack. Is this just a halberd or is this a Mirrodin hammer? I don't know. I don't remember the difference. This is a halberd. You need to play this game? Have it go. This game's awesome. Fail. <laughs> Failed it. I wish more remakes were this good. Oh. Me too. <laughs> A lot of them are just, they really just fall flat, don't they? Okay, well, I'm going behind you. Predator God with the 11-month resubscription. Thanks, Predator. And thanks for the Jesus suck. Give me you. Oh, so we got some firebombs there. Oh, it gave us five elixirs. Not just one. It gives us five. Yeah, see that? Oh, did you da? Oopsies. That's what I was saying. The fire effect is really cool. Really cool. Have you played with... Oh, the meat cleaver is pretty cool. I like the meat cleaver. You get that in, uh, in the Valley of Defilement from Mildred? Yeah, this thing is actually pretty strong early on. Now that was just a master class in three-on-one combat by the Blood God. Doink. Oh, and it's ruined. Clip it before that. Clip it before that. They don't have to know I got hit. Damn, I put my foot on that thing. Oh, they're coming for me. Hit him out of the air. Oh, there we go. So let's get a ring on. A little bit of cling. I am the cling clang god after all. I only play the PS5 version of the game. Do they leave anything out from the original? Leave anything out? No. They just all they change some things like design wise. Just a just a few that I didn't agree with, but they uh they added to the game. They didn't take anything out as far as I know. They did they did take out the platinum the platinum trophy for this game is notorious. Because you need to get an item called Pure Bladestone, which is, I believe that's the Faith Path. You use different rocks to upgrade weapons in different ways, and Bladestone, and maybe, no, maybe it's, no, that was Faint Stone. I forget, Bladestone is something, though. I don't need to go there. But getting it was a really, really rare drop from a pretty difficult enemy. It took me, like, two hours, three hours to get it. Which is atypical. It, t it, takes, it takes players days sometimes to get it. That was a bold leap. A surprise indeed. Well, now that you are here, pray thee, fend off these dreglings. You can fight them yourself. What on earth are you doing? Good luck! We out. This is still your favorite in the series? I love this game. Like, it's got... It's got some level of... I guess you could call it nostalgia. It, it's, it's a little bit... Too late for nostalgia for me. But... It's just... It's the game that changed video games for me. And I still think the first level and the third level are really supremely well-designed through and through. 
Like, Boletaria is like the best castle level ever. One through four. And then Prison of Hope Tower of Latria is the best dungeon prison area you could ever imagine. It just, there's, it just reeks of atmosphere. Obviously, the bosses and the enemies are old, okay? And they're, they're much more limited. But the, the level design is just, it's impeccable. It's impeccable. <laughs> Latria is incredible? Yeah, Latria is... It's just on another level. Um, do I need anything? Yeah, I can get- I can get my same- I usually get the Postmaster General set. Oh, okay. He's gone. Inventory. Let's use his Grey Demon Soul. I hope that's enough. It might not be. Yeah, it's- it's not. Well, I don't need the whole set. I don't need the whole set, do I? Yeah, there we go. Postmaster General. Let me see if I can get the pants, too. Just in case. I want, the, I want shorts, though. Oh, I can't even wear the pants. Can't even wear them. What am I doing? Can I wear the gloves? The glo Oh no, the gloves are super heavy. How do the gloves weigh as much as the pants, bro? How, do how does that make sense? Yeah, I'm not fat rolling. Oh, Jesus! Where did he come from? Wait, I'm going backwards here, right? I don't need to be going here. What am I doing? That guy scared the hell out of me. I'm looking for the, uh, the drakes. The drakes are after the balls, not before. Oh, there's no healing in Demon Souls. Dude, he's cheating. Oh, God. <laughs> totally planned. Dude, he full healed. He's a, he's a dirty cheater. That was a nice move. 69 damage, though. Worked out. Hey, Ignis. You have a good day as well. In Bloodborne, the only game, save for Sekiro for obvious reasons, without the equip burden mechanic? Uh, yes. But I will say this, that the equipment weight is actually still in the game. Just, they took it out in most ways, because they developed the game with it in, but took it out later on in development. But it still exists in one capacity. We figure this out on our stream, actually. The Sometimes in Bloodborne, you'll fall to your death. But sometimes you won't. The same places. This would happen on speedruns. And we never really understood why. And one day, I just, I just noticed that I had, I had equipped like another, another weapon as I fell to my death or before. And we tested it. The weapons add a hidden weight to it. So if you have more weapons equipped, or specifically heavier weapons equipped, you'll get mo a slightly more fall damage, which sometimes would kill you in the game. Would it be safe to say these games change your life? Uh, yeah. I mean, I'm a streamer who primarily plays these games. I mean, I just bought a house.
So yeah, they definitely, uh, they definitely changed my life. <laughs> Are you gonna breathe fire? Oh, that's, 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 that's mean. I need you to breathe, Drake. Your music sucks, Drake. Barely even music. You used to, you used to. What is this guy doing? Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah? Yeah? What are you going to do about it? Oh, yeah. Typical Drake. Get mad. You gotta be careful. This thing's tail can actually- What do you mean? <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's always the last item. It's always the freaking last item. Because quite literally, it is the last item to pick up there. It's it's not like it's like a coincidence or anything. It, it just is the last item. Just got COVID for the first time. What a bummer, but that's not why I'm here. I'm here to see how your metabolism is doing. Oh, I'm doing fine. You know, I'm eating like garbage. But uh, it, it's it's good. It's good to eat like garbage every now and then, right? Right. Oh, bro, dude! Oh my God, I'm getting chopped up. What is this? That's the best boss in the game. Garbage is good for the body. Demon Souls, let's go. This is the one game that got me into the genre. Couldn't stick with anything until I played this. I was just saying, like, th this game, it changed games for me. It just a completely different game than was available at the time. Circa 2009, man. Every game was like trying to be Final Fantasy X. Super, super long winded, long stories. Very little attention to gameplay. And then this game comes out, and it's, like, I, like I've always said, this is these are the adult versions of Zelda games. They're dungeon crawlers, have maybe a puzzle, uh, like some sort of puzzle action in terms of like where you go because of the level design. Awesome enemies, cool weapons, great boss fights. Obviously, the bo the enemies in the boss fights have aged. Things have gotten a lot better since those days. But this game changed games. And then Dark Souls exposed exposed this kind of game to more people because this was a PS3 exclusive. And more people were just able to play Dark Souls because it was on PC. Xbox. <clears throat> it was on Xbox first. I'm so I'm so used to being uh, like now Xbox and PC are, are always combined, but back then it wasn't that way. Some bosses have gimmicks, was adds to it all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I, I gen generally like the ratio of gimmick bosses to, to real bosses. They usually only put a couple in there.
Hmm. Where's my resin? Megrathia with the three-month resubscription. Love the content, Zeus. Keep firebombing the haters. Thanks. Why did they make three Dark Souls? They made four, but they refused to make Sekiro or Bloodborne. Uh, because the guy who's in charge of the company doesn't like really making sequels. He, he likes doing new things. That's why. Feet. Don't lie, that's all you wanted to see. The monumental awaits the above. The all right, let's go. Hey, Silverwind. But why repeat Dark Souls, though? That's the bit you don't understand. Uh, because you live in a culture that... While I, I want new IPs, you live in a culture that wants sequels and remakes. I know I say that playing a remake, but that's just the truth. <laughs> we have long awaited you, Slayer of Demons. He says that as he's playing a remake. I just said that. You're behind the times. But this is the remake of remakes. But here, here's the thing. I'm going to play. L listen, for a game franchise that I love, of, I'm going to play a remake if they, if they make one. But I'm also not going to request any. I, I just... Now, see, with Bluepoint, it's a little bit different, honestly, too. Because Bluepoint is a separate company that is doing it. So it's not like it like a remake takes any time away from from software and what they're making with their their new games. So I really don't mind this when the remake is contracted out to another company and especially Bluepoint. They're quite they're they're the best at remakes. I don't really have a problem with it. But also again, I'm not going to ask for it. I would rather just have new games. But again, this remake didn't interfere at all. Oh, good. I can forge weapons. I don't have the require. Oh, I need hard stones. Okay. I need hard stones to upgrade this. I wouldn't mind Bluepoint basically remaking everything and people choosing to buy it or not. Yeah, but make them on the PS5, though, because this is amazing. Oh, those are sharp stones. I'm not sure what I upgraded this with. This looks prettier than Elden Ring. That's because it's a it's it's made for the PS5, man. What you can do on the PS5 in terms of uh, lighting and graphics, you can't you can't you can't do if you're making a game for like other systems. If you if you specifically develop your game for the PS5, you can make it look better. Obviously, like with a five thousand dollar PC, you can make some PC games look better than this, but. For a $500 system, having a game that looks and plays this, this good and smooth is something that I'd never th think I see, I'd see.
The worst change Blue Point made was changing the name of Sticky White Stuff. I agree. Sticky White Stuff, Old Spice. I wanted... Um, but the the real worst one was the the change of the of the the, the fat ministers that that the 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 officials. I don't know why they changed how those guy lo those guys looked. What's sticky white stuff now? What's it called? Slime? Sticky white slime? Their old laugh was better too. A lot of the the they redid the voice acting. I don't think they really needed to do that. I, I prefer all the old voice acting. Um, I need guys with bags. Any of you have bags? Oopsies. Oh, no. Oh, I have made a mistake. I have made a vast mistake. This game is gorgeous. <clears throat> It is gorgeous. Body forming? No, I, I need I need a, a better weapon. I don't do enough damage. I, for, I forgot to... You don't want to go to 2-1 first. You want to go to 4-1. What's crazy is this game doesn't even have ray tracing. I don't even know what ray tracing is. <laughs> I, and I mean that. Boom. Oh, that's the wrong button. I have a goddamn talisman in my hand. <laughs> Sixty nine damage. Nice. Is the way Jeez. I pretended I knew that was gonna happen. I knew it. I knew it was there. I've played this game before. Hey Rusty, how's it going, dude? What do you mean seventy? I wanted to do sixty nine. Oh, I need more crescents. Oh well. We'll figure it out. Come on. Oh, he got me. He got me good. Okay, I need, I need some more healing, obviously. Don't really want to use my half moons now, but what are you going to do? One at a time. Are you okay, Zeus? You sound a little fed up. What do you, what do you mean I sound fed up? Now I'm fed up with that question. I'm having a good... I'm literally here, chilling out, having a good time, and now I'm mad. I sound fed up. MK with the brand new Twitch Prime subscription. Welcome in. Thanks for that brand new sub. <clears throat> I don't know what I'm going to do with you guys. I actually have no idea. I sound fed up. <laughs> Racist against New Jersey way of speaking. <laughs> Oh, don't, why am I eating mo- oh. Boink. Alright, there's the Crescent Falchion. I wonder how much damage this weapon does on this level, though. I'm gonna find out. Hey Zeus, are you okay? You sound normal. This weapon actually isn't as bad as I thought it would be. 
Oh, dude, I'm I'm fat rolling again. Oh, dude, back handsprings? Or was that that was a cartwheel? That was a cartwheel. Uh, I need the. I don't need this. I need this. There we go. There we go. How do you do this? Hmm. Hmm. Got it. Third time's a charm, baby. I don't think this is going to give me anything good. It's probably going to be like a magic stone or something. Yep, it's, it was a magic stone. Definitely a magic stone. Just got back from Philly and I bought a squirt bottle pin that says jabroni repellent and I immediately dreamt of the beard. Hold on. <sighs> Equipment or items? How do you send to storage? There we go. Okay. I love the sounds in this boss fight. Where are we? Oh, let's just go down here. Oh, can we make it? Yeah, right under the arm. Not the most difficult boss. This thing actually does pretty well against them. The second hit never hits. So... You can probably get three in there. Ah, speedrunner tings. Speedrunner tings. Oh, I wanted to get one extra. That pink stamina bar, though, it looks nice, doesn't it? Oh, I screwed it up. Down the crow goes. Whoa! Look at that tongue! Beautiful. B E A U T F U L. Definitely beautiful, definitely beautiful. Over and over again until they could never misspell either of those words again. Does anybody know what that's from? That might be that might be too hard of a reference for anybody. Does anybody know what that's from? Pretty. Ace Ventura? No. That I, I know I know I know the the B E A beautiful the is from is from that now it's it it's taylor molly it's it's slam poetry if it, if you guys ever ever heard of that 
Bruce Almighty. What is it? Seek us out. Give me the soul power. Ah, yes, of course. Slam poetry. Yeah, I know. This is Twitch. You guys don't read. <clears throat> Actually, slam poetry is verbal. So I need faith, right? I need, well, that's, that's all the faith I need, so might as well get it, and then we can survive a little bit more. We have some vitality. Sure. Oh, I didn't do it. 24, because I need 24 for the large sword of moonlight. Let me see, let me see. Yes, 24. And then we'll just survive a little bit more. I need some more healers. All right, so let's purchase some more crescents. 29, that's good for now. And let me just put everything in the, uh, the storage here that I don't need. I've been ju I've just been seeing the uh, the the storage the thing too much already. Okay, best of luck. So four one. Now we can do two one. We have the the crescent falchion we could use for this. This will be better for this. Put it all in Thomas. You know it. I drank a lot of coffee already, so I'm gonna take a minute break here. I'm drinking more coffee. I'll be right back, guys.
All right. Thanks for sticking around. Dude, I love this level. Oh, it's so cool again. Oh. They tricked me. All right, now let me just test the damage here. What's this like? Well, that was a backstab. Yeah, okay, so much better, much better. And the, and the hammer, let's see. You see, like, it's just certain damage types in this game. Like the buff, the, the scaling with the damage types is insane. You really want the right weapon for the right job here. Yeah, good old Demon Souls, right? Ooh, wrong one. Oh, I was too slow. Slash works best on those wearing no armor. Yeah, but like to the point where you wouldn't expect it though, because they're not wearing armor, but like other damage is negated. That that's the issue. It just doesn't seem like it should work like that. Cause like they're literally a naked dude. But I I mean I he's pretty buff. <laughs> this place on New Game Plus is scary. Well, th isn't this whole game scary on New Game Plus? Like, if you don't have a fully kitted out character in New Game Plus, you're gonna have a rough time. <laughs> what a ridiculous enemy. <laughs> he tries to whip you. He tries to Mario fireball you. And if he misses, he just rubs his tummy and laughs. Yeah, the, the tummy rub. Are you going for the dragon bone spasher? I know I usually do that, but today we're doing something different. We're going for the large sword of moonlight today. It's definitely the roughest New Game Plus transition of the games, but I wish they go back to it. I think it's the best because uh, my, my big problem... Now, they don't have to go back to it fully, but New Game Pluses and Souls games, even Bloodborne, they're too easy. Like, you're fully upgraded, and then the next, the next playthrough is like you're just, you just overpower everything. And, and you think you're good at the game, but you're not. <laughs> I, w I wish it was a bit harder. Just the, the, all the ambient sound is just done so well in this game. And the lighting. I do have the classic filter on. I usually like running with that. Here's a bunch of upgrade materials. Ooh. Some more grass, too. I like DS2 adding new enemies to New Game Plus. Yeah, new enemies. And Neo does that really well. New enemy placements and uh, bosses have more attacks. And a lot of times they're quicker and faster, too. Really like that about Neo. Okay, so we opened up this shortcut. I'm gonna just talk to this blacksmith guy, see if he can upgrade my hammer up my my whatchamacallit. 
my halberd a little bit. Quality, crushing. I don't need that. All right. Wait, what do I need to upgrade it just a little bit? Is Do I need anything else? I need... I need six hard stone shards and one large, so I don't I don't know where to get that. So that that's about as 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 deep as we're taking that, as as deep as possible. Oh, I missed it! Frack! Oh, we gotta go down. Now I'm gonna take this hammer and go into the, the the defilement place and see if I can go get the the sword real quick. Now is it from the first level or the second level? Either way, we got to do level one first. And this is going to be really hard. It's 5-2. We are in for a treat then. Okay, so three are ones with the halberd. Let's see what the falchion does. It's three quicker R ones, still with the falchion. So we'll just stick with this, I guess. Damn, these guys just creep up on you. Let's see if the two hand is two. Love Demon Souls, but you can't stand this area. It sounds like you, you're getting an emotional response to a video game level. I don't know. It might be designed pretty nice. Oh, this is, this is a two-hitter. Cool. All right. It's not as bad as I thought. One-handed, it just wasn't very good. Oh, right to the face. Oh no. Did I just fall to my death? Oh my god. I swear I didn't roll that way. Ugh. Oh, that's rough, dude. That is rough. Ugh. God damn it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just use one of these right now. I'm using it. Hey, Spaghetti, how's it going, dude? I remember the original version of this area used to give you a headache after three hours every time. Well, that's, that's the problem. You're spending three hours here. You can't be doing that. We, we, we got to go through quicker. I'm pretty sure I'd get a major headache after three hours of this place, too. Kill who we need to kill. That is not what I wanted to do. There we ro- Oh, dude, he belly flopped me. All right. 
And we picked up a stone, so we, we kind of didn't even waste one. Pick it up. I mean, this is just awesome. What was that? Something was walking. Oh, no! No, 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 no. I'm, I'm just dead. Dude, I'm dead. There's like, there's no chance of surviving this. There's just no, this is, this is death right here. I'm plagued. I am, I have been plagued. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I don't, dude, this is. Did I survive it? What does plague do? It makes you continually lose health for 35 minutes. I'm actually I, I'm actually mystified that I I survived that. That's 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 really amazing. Hmm. Hmm. There we go. Pine resin. All right, got it. This is going to suck. I can't get hit. I can't get hit. I'm going to get hit, though. Ryu with the KO Ken times 10 gifted subscription hitting me with a major sub cannon straight to the solar plexus you goddamn legend thanks for the 10 gifted subs man uh what he just hit me from whence Yo, Ryu, seriously, thank you so much, man. I didn't mean to do do. I didn't mean to do do. Frack! Come on. Burn the leeches. Leeches! Leeches are my specialty. Dodge them. Right. Oh, you let Zeus, you can't do that. Can't let the leeches suck his blood and then give him the blood back. Oh, god damn it. Hit him in the leech crotch. All right. That was better than I thought it would be. Always got to go for the leech crotch, though. Yo, Enhab with the two-month Twitch Prime resubscription. Thanks, Enhab. Most Demon Souls bosses are very easy compared to other Souls games. Oh, definitely. Yeah.
All right, so we have the faith we need. Soul of the lost. Well, we probably should get some more. We'll get some endurance, we'll get some vitality, and we'll get some faith. That works. So the world might be met. Art thou finished? I can forge weapons. Do come back alive. All right. Now, I'm not sure exactly where the sword is, but I know it's I know it's on a ramp. If I see it, I'll probably know it. I just hope my damage is is good for this area. Either way, we should be fine. You can tell they were trying things out. I really like my first playthrough of the remake after having not played the original and you can see all these little gameplay details that they dropped in later games but others that they kept yeah i mean this was uh this was miyazaki's first standalone game as director um so he he tried a bunch of things out yeah that's gonna be hard that's gonna be pretty hard doesn't the sword have a strength requirement it just says stats needed 24 and faith. I'm pretty sure that's faith. No, I don't think it has a, a strength requirement. Oh, dude, it's all swampy. This is actually really cool. Oh, in the swamp again. And now I'm poisoned. Oh yeah, if you try to roll in the swamp, you get, ah, oh, you get encumbered. Okay. Ooh. These things are so cool. Do you get anything for killing one? Not really. World Tendency is one of the most inter interesting mechanics. I really think, yeah, I think World Tendency is pretty cool. Although, I'm not sure if I'd want it in other games. But I, w I wish there were some more different mechanics like that in the games. I'm not sure if any of this stuff is good. <gasps> That's not good, though. No, we're not going over there. Never understood the world tendency mechanic. It's pretty simple, man. If you die in body form, you start neutral, right? If you die in body form, you get minus one. If you kill a boss, you get plus one. If you kill a, a, a black phantom or a red phantom, you get plus one. If you kill like, a, like an NPC character, you get minus one or minus two, depending on... Depending on. And then basically, when, once you go, I think it's either three or four levels up or down for pure black and pure white, different things happen. Different paths open up, different characters appear, you're able to get different, all sorts of different things. Oh no. Is this the, this must be the ramp, right? Freaking wasps. Mosquitoes, whatever they are. Oh, that's a lot of damage. And that's not a lot of healing. Hold on. Work smarter, not harder. There we go. 
Trolling stream and ran into Dead by Daylight daily, dating simmer, simulator? Yeah, I've seen that. I've seen that. Well, I haven't actually seen it. I've heard about it. Maybe I'll play it. What? There's an... Oh! 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 Get it off! Get it off! Get it off! What is happening? Kill it! I've never seen that before. I've never... Whoa! I've never seen that before. Jesus Christ, it was sucking me. I kind of liked it. Oh, I'm going to die. I'm dead. I'm so dead. I'm alive. Okay. All right. Well, I guess we just go back. <laughs> I don't know if that's the right ramp, though, because I, th I remember the ramp having lots of slugs, but that's the only ramp I see. Maybe there's a... Maybe it might be a second ramp. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just take this all the way because I don't have any other choice. <gasps> Wait, I can't get back? Oh, no. Oh, that's actually terrible. So I, I can't fall... Dude, I can't fall down? Oh my god, this game is brutal. I wish the D DVD dating sim wasn't a visual no novel. I don't know what I was expecting. This is crazy. Watched a Bloodborne speedrun on IGN you did four years ago where your time was 31 minutes, I think. What a time. Hey, thanks, dude. That was a pretty good... I think it was... I think it was... 29-something um, in-game time. That was a pretty... That was a real good time back then. It's, it's not a good time anymore. But thanks for watching. Can I not even... Bro. You're kidding. Oh, my God. I just gotta... I just gotta leave. I just gotta leave. I gotta... I just gotta do... I just gotta do the, do the level again. Jortiz with the 30-month resubscription. Thanks so much, Jortiz. So you fall, you die? No, 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 no. That's I'm trying to get an item. I could I could continue the level. I'm just trying to get a specific item. I need to go up that ramp. So you you can finish the level. All you had to do was go uh, just continue on in the swamp there, and you would have been fine. But I guess I guess you have one opportunity on this ramp. Do the heals work less efficiently when poisoned? You notice? Yeah, they do. Maybe if you just do it, you can get the item. Thanks for the help. <laughs> Poisoned. Chat, you're fantastic. Yeah, we, we got a pretty good chat here. There's a second way up the ramp. Where were you 10 minutes ago? Thanks for your help. <laughs> Where's the second way? Oh, there's some lotuses.
All right. Let's heal up. Damn it. Don't fall. Okay. Not the best, but we took care of him. Oh, I got lucky with that one. Come on, little guy. Come on, you stupid blood sucking flying monstrosity oh he's sweeping oh no he's just lighting a sword I thought he was cleaning the place up like there was one little dregling trying to make the place a little bit nicer for everybody oh no no thank you Hey Zeus, really appreciate the content. Usually just lurk while I'm working. Just notice that I got gifted a sub, so paying it forward. Uh, try refreshing the page. Oh, I, I, I'm, it's just not coming up, man. But thanks in advance. Oh, there we go. Oh no! No! Perfect timing. Perfect timing. Smith Ma Peter with the KO Ken times five gifted subscription hitting me with a sub cannon straight to the solar plexus. You goddamn legend. Thanks for the five gifted subs. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Did you die full body? I did. My tendency is going to go down. <laughs> Back to the shadows I go. <laughs> oh, you, you coordinated with that dregling, huh? That's the wrong ramp anyways. That's the second ramp. What do you mean there's a second ramp? Somebody told me that was the ramp. He's right, it's further along, you know, you know. There's two ramps. Well, you know what? Since there's two ramps, here's two ads. Aren't the ramps connected? How am I supposed to know? I haven't played this game like this. I usually just skip all this nonsense. I get I usually play this like at the Dragon Bone Smasher and just one shot everything. What was that squelching? I'm, I'm done playing around with these jabronis. Oh god, it's a trap! Is there another one behind me? No, okay. No!
Well, we got a few more attempts at this. The, uh, yeah, the audio did trick me. Improperly designed game. Queen yarn them all over again. I'm dying on purpose. You know how it is. I'll, I'll do it this time. This this will be the successful run through. You heard it behind too. It was behind me. Shadow Man with the six month resubscription. Thanks, Shadow Man. Did he die a lot to the queen yesterday? No. No. All I could say is don't fight the queen with your bare chest and really low rapid poison resistance. You literally get two shot by everything. That's all I could say. <laughs> the ramps, oh, the ramps aren't even connected. So I've been just dying on the wrong ramp for no reason for 15 minutes. That's what you're trying to tell me here. Smart Lurker with the nine month resubscription. Enjoy your brand new slug baby. Make sure you slime it every single day. Thanks, Smart Lurker. And enjoying it. Ah, Faisal. I'd expect no less. Okay, so we're not going to this ramp. We're going to the second ramp. This ramp is stupid. <laughs> yes, yes, I get it. Yeah, I don't think I want to engage in combat with five mosquitoes. Aha! Now we found some slugs. This is the right way. Where's the other ramp, though? I'm not here. Be very, very quiet. No! Oh, it scared me. I'm not here. I'm not here. There's nobody here sloshing through the muck. Not one person. It's like Breaking Bad and there's a second ramp. Oh, did he hear me? Oh, he's mad. He sees me up here. Get off my ramp. That's how he talks. No, don't fall down, you idiot. Okay. A sucker stone shard. Oh, is that it right there? Oh! No! 
That had to be it, right? Can I can I survive that? Ooh, dude, that's a lot. That's a lot of slugs. I'm dude, I thought that was crescent moon grass. What is wrong with me? I don't know. I think I used all my fire bombs. Time to exterminate some slugs. Oh, no. Pick it up. There we go. What's this? It's fine. It's fine. Oh, don't hit me. Do not hit me. All right. Whoa! Pretty! Wait, did I just do 28 damage with my big glowy stick? 28 whole damage? Hold on, I gotta test this thing. Okay, no, it wasn't just 28. It was just 28 because that's all it had left. Dude, that it, it looks cool. It looks cool. What do you think it smells like? Gunpowder. Because that's what the moon smells like. Okay, so I have... No need for poison anymore. This lady, she sells some good stuff. So we're going to buy some good stuff from here. She's got the full moon grass. She's got the... Preservation. The mace. The male coif? What is that? What is a male coif? Recover HP over time? Hmm. I'm just gonna get some of these. For later. Bro, I just spent so much money on you. Don't get don't give me that. Your child is hungry. Oh god! My child is hungry! No! No, <laughs> bro. <laughs> Dude, the death. Unbelievable. Dude, they just rush you. They just rush you so freaking hard. Ugh. I got to do the whole thing again. I'm just going to come back here later. <laughs> this is going to make the world tendency so bad, but I'm just going to come back here later.
You hate that level with an unholy passion? All right. At least we're bonking things good. This thing looks sick, man. I wasn't expecting it to look this good. Man, it's gorgeous. I thought the fire zone was a little bit different. What sword is that? The large sword of moonlight. Whoa. <laughs> Let's go, dude. <laughs> That was sick. This is freaking sick, man. I love this game. And the the re the remake is re is really good. I didn't realize that this thing was gargantuanly strong. I thought this was going to be like a weak weapon in the beginning. I was kind of worried. This is amazing. Oh! That's sick. That is sick. This thing is too strong. I mean, the Dragon Bone Smasher is stronger than this, so I don't, you know. When is the Moonlight Greatsword ever weak? I mean, that's fair. <laughs> oh, he's got the blue magic too. Look at him. Down he go. Oh, I got hit. <clears throat> I got to go for his weak spot. Crotch shot. Crotch shot. Oh, damn. Jeez, bro. Bro, give me a chance to do something. Oh, man! He was mad. Death to the crotch! Ah! <laughs> I love the, the sound they all make when they just die. Oh, that was good. It's not weak, but the Holy Moonlight Sword from Bloodborne isn't all that great. Uh, see, the thing is, you need the gems to make it good. And most likely, you, you don't have the right gems on it. But you are right. It, does, it doesn't start out as being like a super, super strong weapon. We could probably do this level now. 
You love this boss. It reminds you so much of being a child and playing this area with your brother and dad. Ah, nostalgia's good, isn't it? Nostalgia's good. Arcane's more tricky than trick weapons. It's just, it's just that you, like, it, the game sort of requires you to pay attention to the gems and their effects. And it also sorts of, it sort of expects you to go into the chalices as well. Oh, wait, I'm going the wrong way. I forgot, I, I already did this. So it's, it's very easy to overlook that stuff. Gonna get the trophy for beating without killing the archers? Oh, I've already done that. Man, this weapon looks nice, dude. They did a good job with this. Moonlight effect OP. Oh, damn. I like- I'm glad that I did this. I'm having fun. Nope, other way. Have you platted the remake? I don't think so, Belle. How do I check that? Demon Souls. Trophies. Dark Souls. Neo 2. Sekido. I haven't even platinum Sekido. What do I need to platinum Sekido? What is where is this game? God of War? Rocket League? Did I pass it? Pinball Arcade? What is this game called? Demon Soul. Like I have the PS3 one. I didn't pass it. I'm, I'm an expert speed reader. Why isn't it at the top? I'm literally playing this game. 74%. So what do I need? Return to form. Help a player vanquish a boss. Oh. Very rare hidden trophy. Okay, thanks for telling me. Very rare hidden trophy. All magic spells, all rings. And a few hidden ones. That's what I'm missing. Oh, they're chasing me. You can view the hidden one. Dude, those things just light you up super quick, huh? I remember on speed... I used to speedrun this game for, for a little while. Those things would kill me every now and then. If you don't just, like, run through them... They could just, like, instant kill you. Bro, this weapon is sick! It's actually, like, it's a good, good weapon for this game. It's, it's OP as hell. As long as you have PlayStation Plus, you can view hidden trophies. It's literally pay to win? You never knew that? Oh, poison res- I thought that was flame resistance. Where's the flame resistance ring? You don't need PlayStation Plus? Man, it's like every 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 single thing that Twitch chat tells me, Twitch chat also tells me the exact opposite. <laughs> Just press square to view hidden trophies.
This is very important that we do this, guys. Vanquish Maiden Astraya without killing Garl Vinland. Oh. Obtain Isterel. Why Isterel? That's that's like a faith wooden spear, if I remember correctly. Why is that? Why is there a trophy just for that one? I forget where the fire resistance ring is. Glad I could help, dude. Thanks so much. Thank you so much. That trail on the weapon swing? Yeah, it's sick, man. And it's like, it's delayed a little bit. Like, it's, it's, it's really nice. I love this boss. God damn it. Spreading that oil. Light it up. I love how you actually fight this thing's penis. It's not its penis, it's its stinger. It's different. Oh, Jesus. Is it though? Yes, it is. <laughs> I actually really kind of need more healing before I go and do this, but whatever. We'll try it anyway. This room is the bane of your gaming life. It's, dude, I know how to do it, and it still kills me every now and then because a few, a few of those, those jumps or, or landings, they're, you gotta be kind of perfect on it. You gotta be kind of perfect. Oh, there's the flame resistance ring. Why didn't you say anything? Zeus, do you recommend playing this? Absolutely. Ab uh, uh, yes. Yes. Look at this boss and tell me this game's not worth playing.
Ooh, okay. I was too early on that. Frack me, dude. This is actually not as good as I thought it was going to be against this guy. Really? It, that's just not as good as I thought, uh, not as much damage as I thought I was going to get against him. That was rough. Just do jumping attacks. Going to upgrade the glow stick? No, I really can't. Unless I do tendency events. I don't think I have any... No. I do not. Where... I need the cling ring now. Try again! Use a summon? Shut your mouth, Goose Fraba. Use a summon. You need the soul of the flame lurker in order to upgrade the weapon. That's also true. Yeah, you're right. If I don't get him this time, this might be a boss I come back to a little later. But we'll see how it goes. not want to do that but see I was an inch away from dying there one inch you love souls games but you're so bad at it but you always end up giving playing I mean I would I would try this game man and just really sit down and try to try to beat it. Same thing happened to me when I first played this game. I gave up. It was too hard for me. And then I just didn't want the game to win. Gotta play like Dark Souls. Gotta play like Dark Souls. I'm using a big giant glow sword. Nice! That was a beautiful dodge. Don't step on the lava, Zeus. Oh, he's mad. Oh, he's real mad. He hasn't even hit me yet. I just jinxed myself.
He's gonna he's gonna flame up soon. Oh, and there goes the jinx. There goes the jinx. Oh, that was a big shot from a big boy. I can't see. It's fine. Kill it! With the booty slap! Haha, <laughs> that was a good fight. Oh man, that guy's so good. He's got six attacks, but he keeps you on the edge of your seat when you fight him. Nate D313 with a nine month resubscription. Enjoy your brand new slug baby. Make sure you slime it every single day. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Hey, Neggy. Zeus looking genuinely happy. Ha happy? Yeah, I'm looking happy. I don't know what's wrong with me, guys. I, it's li listen, I'm the Moonlight Sword is awesome. I wasn't expecting it to be this fun, and I, I was expecting this to be a little bit, you know, rough. It, wa it, it was rough getting it. It was rough getting it, but this is definitely fun. Then touch the touch the demon inside me. Okay, so... Dragon God. He's just a happy boy. Yes, he is. One of the only real boss fights in the game. Well, if you're judging it by today's standards, yeah. I like how he does appropriate damage, though. You know, like if you get if you get hit as long as you're not going there late game, if you get hit twice, three times, you're dead. I don't I don't like it when bosses can hit people like five, six, seven times and they're still like, yep, I'm living. Nice, we actually did it right. Press the button. Joe Moore with the seven month Twitch Prime resubscription. Thanks, Joe. Hope you've been well, dude. Good to see you. Did the Moonlight Sword come from Demon Souls? It came from King's Field originally. It's, it was even an armored core, I've been told. But I think Kingsfield was the first game it appeared in for From Software. Oh! Um... Well, I did that wrong. Good thing I have high faith. I believed in myself, therefore I didn't die to the fire. That's how it works. Frack! I believe again! I believe! Yeah, buddy.
the Master's Ring. I used to always use this in PvP with my guillotine axe. The Master's Ring, if I remember correctly, gives you 20% extra damage on clean hits. Like, that's when you hit the enemy perfectly. This is, yeah, this actually is a stealth mission, boss. Mm. Work sucks today. Had a customer looking to pick up their special order windows. I say, okay, let's go down and get them. Look through the special order shed and they're nowhere to be found. I thought, well, maybe they got shipped to our sister store. Oh, your sister has a store? Call them. They look nothing. I called the manufacturer and come to find out that they haven't even shipped yet as there was a delay in making them. The customer just assumed that they were here because of the date they told me they'd be here. Well, you know, you did tell them they'd be there. Just like you tell me. I'm, I, you, t you tell me, Zeus, every day I'll be at your stream 8.30 in the morning. And then, you know, 8.39 comes, 8.41 comes, and you're like, I'm not late. So I'm actually beginning to see, I'm beginning to see a little bit of an issue with the customer service at your, your place of employment here. I, I, you t if you tell me you're going to be here at the date I, and the time, I, what do you, you got to tell me they're not here then. Sorry, they're running late. That one's on you. I mean, I, if, if I... If I, tell, if I told someone that they were going to be ready by so-and-so date, it would be ready. I, I don't know. You Listen, I pay you. You tell me a date. It's on you to get them by that date. I'm take, you know what? I'm taking my business elsewhere. You're not getting any more lumber business and window business from me. Ha-ha. <laughs> Are there okay? Are there what what is are there any easy colorless souls to get? What's the easiest colorless soul to get? Probably in like Stone Fang, right? Probably Stone Fang. Oh, Snuggy Snuggly has one. What do you have to trade with Snuggly to get it? Turn in the faith talisman. Ooh, okay. Snuggly the crow. Oh, you get one for the, where, where do you get the gold mask though? Where's that? I don't remember that item. This sword is awesome. This sword is really fun. It just looks cool. It makes it better. I'm pretty sure I hit a home run there. Perfect timing. Uh, a little bit late. A little bit late. It's okay. I shot it the other way. Upper Latria, after you drop the heart, you can get it. But like, okay, so where in Upper Latria? After you drop the heart. That, that could be a lot of places. Uh, where's the crow? Wait, where's the crow now? No, that's not the crow. Oh, I forgot where the crow is. Oh, I'm getting turned around here.
Hmm, I forget how to get there. Is, isn't it like right in here? Or is it is the next tower? It's the next tower. That's what it is. It's down there. Nope. This isn't it. So if it's not there, I'm assuming it's got to be over here somewhere? Left side after the first stairs? I bonked. Oh, no. Oh, thank God. No durs. So it's not down here? Does no durs mean no? No durs. Here it is. This is it. What do you mean no durs? Where's my talisman? Do I have to... Yeah. Yeah. Gotta quit out. They meant yesters. Zeus is a boomer for not knowing what nodders is. No, Skyzark, you're a boomer for not understanding my sarcasm. Wait, what am I doing? Continue. Okay. So... Well, I guess I got to go back the, the original way. God, this game is so cool. It's just so cool. Freaking Steve Irwin mur murderers flying through. Oh, it's the best. Oh, it's so much better than stupid Dark Souls. Be right back, gonna cry. <laughs> These look like mana rays, not so much sting rays. Oh, shut your mouth. Ugh. Demon Souls over Dark Souls? God, no. What is wrong with you? Except for the DLC. I mean, bro, this place, this, this lady? No. Don't tell me. Yeah, Demon Souls is the best souls. Tell them. Started Bloodborne not so long ago, and I found your vids, world records, and it made me want to play and mo know more about the Souls lore in general. Hey, that, that's kind of the best thing a streamer could hear. Keep down the path. It, it's, it's a fun franchise, man. It's a fun franchise, that's for sure. With it, I can bring me it. 
All right, now we gave him the, the Flame Lurker Soul so we can upgrade our large Sword of Moonlight with the colorless demon soul we just got. Well done. Cool. We're RPGsing. Oh, that's not it. <laughs> it's gonna get a new title also? What's getting a new title? Soulsborne exclusives are the best. Banjo-Kazooie? You know, I never played Banjo-Kazooie. I had it. I didn't really like it, though. It just wasn't a game that I really, uh, really enjoyed. Hmm. All right, let's go to Latria, I suppose. Best level in the game. If you have the Nintendo membership, get, yeah, no. <laughs> I do not. The vi yeah, the visual effects, the particle effects in this game. The PS5 can do some awesome stuff with particles. You got me. Slice them in half. <laughs> How you got the moon sword? So you gotta beat five one, then go into five two. Uh, there's a, a, a poison swamp with jellyfish you gotta wade through. Go to the end of that. There's gonna be two big guys and some little guys right before a ramp. Don't go on that ramp. Get in the swamp. Go past the ramp. The lamp. The, the ramp! Oh my god! Go past the ramp and stay all the way to the left. All the way to the left. You'll find another ramp eventually. Go up that ramp. At the top of it, there is a group of slugs. And you'll know you're on the right ramp because there's slugs before it and on it. Chop down the group of slugs. And then go down to where it falls and the Moonlight Sword will be there. BB Yoki with the brand new Twitch Prime subscription. Welcome in. Thanks for that brand new sub. Zeus uses Winamp confirmed. You know it. Winamp, WinRAR, give me the win. How many wamps? I feel like you guys are making fun of me now. In the way that I talk. Any plans playing a real game like Bloodborne? Were you not here yesterday? I played Bloodborne and I did all every single boss in the game. Main game, optional, DLC, and every single story chalice in one run. And I did it playing, a, playing it as Pyramid Head. Yeah, where were you yesterday? Where were you yesterday? What a lovely singing voice. Oh, that's not it. <laughs> this way. Not gonna lie, Miyazaki has been absolutely punishing Zeus every time he plays Bloodborne. 
Bloodborne has a conscience consciousness. It's alive. It gets very mad at me when I play other games. And when I come back to it, it ups the difficulty. You remember getting lost here so much? Yeah, th this, it, it took me a while to figure out where to go in this level. A long, long time. Scheduled procedure this morning for October 20th. What are you, what are you getting done, man? Pale Blood Skies with the 20 month resubscription. Thanks so much, Pale Blood. All right, Troy, yeah. How freaking awesome, man. How fri Who the friggin' cares how awesome this is? Oh, this way. I gotta go up the tower. Don't forget the little creep. <laughs> I got turned around on the steps there. Jesus, I'm getting dizzy. These levels are just really great at letting you see what's what's coming before you actually go there. Where's the hole? There's the hole. It's always hard to find the hole. Sliced her up. Oh, we got a stone of ephemeral eye. Ooh, two of them. I should kill her more often. First time you played this game, you didn't even know you had to kill that guy. It was fun. Oh, yeah. And I had no idea what to do, right? I, Dude, wandering. I replayed the whole level so many times. I didn't realize that I had to kill him until I talked to him again. I'm using the classic filter. Looks the best. <laughs> Look, it's the doll. The doll is evil. Damn, I should braid my hair like that. I bet I look real good. Frack! <laughs> Not her. It's her. Oh, 
Oh! Stepped on a trap. Damn it! <laughs> Who was that? I never even noticed that. You love the looks of the fool's idol? One of your favorite boss looks? Yeah, she's awesome looking. She sounds cool. She's a good doll demon. Look, Dark Souls just stole this scene from Demon Souls, a much better, more original game. Oh my god, I fell down the hole! I gotta go through the whole level again. The whole, the whole, the whole freaking level again. That idol was laughing, thinking that the guy would be healing her forever. When she died, she sounded surprised, like, what, where's my heal? You know, that's a very good little detail that you picked up on there. I guess we get to appreciate the beauty and grandeur and mastery of this level all over again. It only takes a minute to run through. Left, right, left, right. Jeez, which way do I go? Zap. Madcap with a seven month resubscription. Thanks, Madcap. Love you on your stream, Zeus. Thanks for everything you do for us viewers. Hey, thanks for everything you do for me. Four arms? Jealous. I wish I had four arms. Such a long run back. I don't mind it, though. The place looks amazing. Like I said, I love this level. Oh, like the green tone. Ugh. It's like, you know what the green remind like this reminds me of um, Lord of the Rings. What's what's Minus Morgul? Where the where the, the Witch King lives? Am I correct in that? Where the wraiths come out of? Yeah, exactly. No, not Moria. I think I think it's called Minus Morgul. Here, let me show you. This place. See the green? Boom. I was right. Minus Morgul. I, I actually have a memory still.
you never watched Lord of the Rings, that's fine. Go read it, and then you could watch it. This place is awesome. Should read it again? Yeah, I'm thinking about doing it. It's been it's been a while since I have. That's the correct answer. The books are so good. Really just one book. It was written as one book, but it was uh, divided into other books for publication purposes. What if you watch the movies but have not read the books, even though you... Oh, I would say, still, like, you, you should read the books if you haven't. It's... It's pretty amazing. Three books make so much more money than one book? Uh, it's more like it's, it was really, really hard to pu mass publish a giant book back then. Like, you could do it much easier now. What book? The Lord of the Rings? No! Bro, I was a half a second too late. What the hell? Lord of the Rings are the best movies made. They are really good movies. Coolest armor set ever. The gloom armor. Ah, oh, so good. Mm. Samwise is your boy. I think he's everyone's boy. You try to read A Clockwork Orange is more twisted than the movie. Yeah, A Clockwork Orange is not really... I don't know, man. It do, it's to me it's not really worth it or it doesn't really say anything interesting I don't know I didn't, I didn't really like the the book or the movie personally I see I'm a I'm a big Cormac McCarthy fan and Cormac McCarthy he writes a, a lot of a lot of his books are about like the, the depths of depravity the lowest of the lows. And he, he finds a way to make you think about these situations. What they mean for the people involved in them. Their characters and their expectations. Clockwork Orange just seems mindless. At least to me. You just read Blood Meridian, it was so good. Yeah, Blood Meridian is... Just one of the best books ever written. There's so much... Just on a surface level, it's really good. But then there's so much... So much going on in that book. In the subtext underneath the surface. I could talk for days about that book. 
Just ordered the hardcover deluxe edition of the Lord of the Rings. I'll read it now just for you. I'm actually, I have, I have the, I have like the, I don't know. It was an anniversary edition. Really, really nice book. I'm going to read, I'm going to read that version of it. Oops. <laughs> the tuning fork armor. You're not wrong. <laughs> That's the one you're getting, the 50th anniversary one? Yeah, it's a real nice book. I don't take too kindly to that. Do you read Shakespeare? I haven't in a while, but I've I've read and I, I, I have a literature degree. I, I read a lot of Shakespeare. Hamlet, Othello, Titus Andronicus, Thir Twelfth Night, Romeo and Juliet. You have Lord of the Rings, The Hobbit, and The Silmarillion signed by Tolkien's daughter. That family. Imagine, imagine, imagine having such an ego. You'd you'd sign your father's book. <laughs> Speaking of Hamlet. My area of Illinois had a wild hemlock issue that got a lot of people sick. <laughs> oh, Macbeth, that's a good one. Macbeth is awesome. There's a book by Margaret Atwood called Hagseed, which is all about the Tempest. Really good book. The Blind Assassin. If you like Margaret Atwood, even if you don't, if you like, if you like, it's like half a science fiction story, half real. Really, really fun book. You'd like to start the Cimmerillion, but it seems intimidating. Uh, as far as I'm concerned, it's not really worth it. I don't know. It reads more like a history book than something well written. You should do a reading stream. The problem is, like, I, a lot of things, like, I'm not actually even allowed to read on stream. Like, I, I, I could only do old things. And also, this is Twitch. Please give you all the book recs. The, the books that I like the most are Blood Meridian by Cormac McCarthy, Frankenstein by Mary Wollstonecraft Shelley. I like Against the Day by Thomas Pynchon. And the Brothers Karamazov by Fyodor Dostoevsky, as well as the Lord of the Rings. Though those are the books that, to me, are my favorites, and it covers like a lot of different styles of writing. Crying of Lot Forty Nine is a good pension book. I haven't read that one yet. Stranger in a Strange Land. That's that's a really good science fiction slash religion book. Get the uncut version, though. Call of Cthulhu? No, I... Wait, where am I going? I'm got, Dude, am I doing this whole thing again? I went the wrong way, didn't I? Oh, my God. 
You're a big Neil Gaiman fan. I never read anything that he he wrote except for Sandman. I like I like Sandman. I went I went the wrong way. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna go back. Screw that. And Stephen King like his books? Yeah, Stephen King's more on the, the entertainment side of things. Uh, my favorite of his, though, is The Gunslinger. I really like that book as a standalone. The series is good for me for a while, but the, the, the first book, The Gunslinger, is really, really good. Um, where do I go again? I, am I lost? Yeah, I am definitely lost. I gotta go to the big... Uh, th I gotta go up there. I gotta go up there. If you want to feel depressed, read The Road by Cormac McCarthy. The Road's really good. The road's amazing. It's what got Cormac McCarthy known by anyone who wasn't already into books, especially American literature. Cormac McCarthy has a bunch of different writing styles. He started off really Southern Gothic, think like William Faulkner. Um, then he developed this really beautiful Western Romantic style, and that's Romantic capital R of writing for the Border Trilogy with all the pretty horses and the crossing and Cities of the Plain. And then for, like, No Country for Old Men and The Road, he, he came up with this in insanely stark and bleak writing style with very little pomp to it. But it works phenomen phenomenally well, especially for the Armageddon setting of the road. You had no idea he wrote Nug Country for Old Men? Yep. Mm-hmm. He, uh, he has this dual book coming out in a few months, which I'm excited for. Hey, McCrood. Yeah, All the Pretty Horses is really good. The Crossing's really good. Cities of the Plain doesn't really do much for me, honestly. Uh, but he has, uh, he, he's got a, lot of, a, got a lot of really good, really good books that he's written. Also, the, he, he wrote a play called The Sunset Limited, which is really good. I recommend that. And then we can get into drama. I love, I love drama. <laughs> I used to I, back when I lived more north I used to go like to Broadway off Broadway plays a lot and I'm not talking about like musicals like I saw Jude Law play Hamlet I saw uh, Ian McKellen and Patrick Stewart in Waiting for Godot I saw Felicia Rashad in um August Osage County. I saw I saw a lot of really good things. A lot of really good actors. Boom. You guys might need to lead me towards that, uh, that, that gold mask. I need a little bit more damage.
Would love to see Felicia Rashad. And in August, Osage County, dude, like she was cursing up a storm. It was it was a sight to see. Because normally you don't really associate her with having a foul mouth. But she plays the mother. And man, she is wild. That was a really that was a really I saw that with my mom. I really the the set for that play was really well done. They had like a three-story house. Really cool. Sounds interesting, you wouldn't expect it from her? Yeah, it was real good. Ian McKellen did this theater show that was kind of him reminiscing on life and his favorite shows. Gotta see him do some Gandalf speeches in person. Yeah, I like Ian McKellen. He's a good actor. If you don't die, I'll hit my nut button for you. Hit the nut button. So where's that gold mask? Where is that gold mask? I want to go get that. You've passed it at this point in Atlas Plateau. You guys are so helpful. Like, you seriously, you just, I, lo I love, I love every day coming on this broadcast, asking for help and getting it from you. It's just wonderful. Dun -na 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 <laughs> Billy Joe. Man, I haven't listened to Green Day in a while. I wish I could put it on right now. Real voice activated. Mickey Mouse playing Demon Souls. Starling Marte has a Mickey Mouse, like a studded out diamond Mickey Mouse necklace. What a legend. So seriously, where do I go? No, nobody knows where the gold mask is. It's in this tower you're in now. Okay. So how do I get there? Way down below? Way down below? All the way down. Oh, Lord heaven knows. Can I go lower? How do I go lower? This it? That's not it. That's not it. You guys are lying to me. How do I get down there? Where the big heart fell. What do you mean I was there? You said it was here. Turn around, okay? But that's up. How do I get down? Where you just picked up that item. There's some pots you can break. You destructive little minx. All right, I broke the pots. Can I climb this? Turn right, okay?
Oh. Aha! Oh god. No, stop it. Examine. Ooh, the gargoyle crossbow. Is this it? Nope. All this for a stupid mask, huh? Oh, right to the neck. Is it? Not even it. Not even it. Yo, this place is cool. I haven't been here in a while. Oh, it's all bloody and goopy. Just my kind of thing. Oh, a ring of avarice. Really? There's the gold mask. Oh, and we got the Epe Rapier. I was more of a foil guy myself. Actually, no, I was Saber. What am I talking about? I was Saber. Actually, I think it's pronounced Sabre. Wait. Oh, the, sh the archstone shard is just one at a time? Oh, I gotta go all the way back now? Jesus! <laughs> you would love to fence me? No, you wouldn't. I would dominate you. I am I am a swordsman master. Can't be beat. Using this weapon was the most fun you had in this game. I'm so glad that I did this today. Normally I run with a dragon bone smasher, but this is this is something else to add to the repertoire. Are there any other what 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 other weapons do you guys like? Any other cool weapons in this game? I'll fence you if you use the writer palash. I'll use a saw cleaver. When fencing, would you call out the R ones and the L ones? You know it. Isn't there a punching weapon? The hands of God? Yeah, I think they suck, though. I think that's like a, te a terrible, terrible, basically unusable weapon, if, I, if I'm remembering correctly. The butcher's knife is a boss weapon from the 4-1 fat guy. How do you, how do you get it? Best cutscene in the game. Enjoy.
What's for lunch? Ooh, that's a good question. What is for lunch? Do you want anything? Specific? Okay. That is not a lot of damages. Yes, you don't know, though. I mean, we can get Italian, we can get... Chinese? The audio in this game is so good, it is astounding. It's hard to believe this game came out before Dark Souls. Well, this is the remastered version. That's why it looks better, if that's what you mean. You guys eat out for lunch every day? No. Not every day. They made the Moonlight Sword really pretty in this version. They did. It's super cool, isn't it? No healing allowed. Wait, Ludwig's holy blade in Bloodborne is a reference to the Moonlight Sword? No, the... The Moonlight Greatsword in Bloodborne is the Moonlight Greatsword that is in Demon Souls, Dark Souls, DS2, DS3, Bloodborne. Does Elden Ring have run? Uh, Kingsfield has it. Armored Core has it. Se Sekido doesn't have one. Sekido has a Moonlight Sword. It has the Dark Moon Blade. Wait, it, there's a Dark Moon Blade in Sekido? You're lying to me. Is it like one of the upgrades? Sekido doesn't? Stop. In Elden Ring? No. God, I hate you. I hate all of you. <laughs> I can forge weapons. All right, let's uh, let's get our wait. We got to go to the crow first. 
And then we can go and upgrade the weapon. Elden Ring tomorrow? No, tomorrow I'm playing God of War. I'll be playing the original God of War, well, the HD remastered version tomorrow. As as long as long as I still feel like it. What? <laughs> hey, I clearly hit him. I thought Zeus didn't like God of War. I've never played God of War. But I have played God of War, and I liked parts of God of War, and there are parts of God of War that I didn't like. But I still haven't played God of War. Um, even though I have played the other God of War. It's not my fault that you're confused. It's the fault of the idiotic company that made a game called God of War, and then like 15 years later made another game called God of War. So I don't really know what to tell you. Is it a reboot though, when they take the same character and, and just make him older? and make all the past events still still canon <laughs> so it's like they're it's like it's a sequel but they didn't put the nu the number on the title of the game for for some reason Is it what's classed as a soft reboot? No, there's, there's, there's in no way is it a reboot. I'm just, it's just semantics, but it's not, it's not a reboot. It's, it continues the same story and this, it's the same character. Try the third remastered. Well, I'm going to play the first one first. And uh, if we if we like it and the streams do well, we'll continue on with it. You know how I do. Can I kill this guy? Yep. I can. Oh, what's this? Oh, soul remains. So is tomorrow God of War? Or or is it God of War? It's God of War. See, I'm I'm very anal about calling games their appropriate name. I just want to give the developers the respect that they deserve. Especially when we're talking about games that I like. So like people people say say DS1 or DES. I don't do that. It's Dark Souls. It's Demon's Souls. Not Demon Souls, Demon's Souls. So it's God of War. And it's also God of War. It's not my fault. Not my fault. Hey knives. Is it Gowl? What is Gowl? Is it God of War 2018? That's not a that's not a title of a game. No. That's not a title of a game. I only I only know the games God of War and God of War. I don't know God of War 2018. 
They should have named it Demons as Souls. All right. All done. Blades of Mercy. Can someone ban Havoco Gaming? <laughs> we should avoid all the confusion and just play God of War 3. No, nah, I don't want to do that. People tell... Okay, so those of you guys who like got the original God of Wars, is is the first one good? Is it worth playing? Or is it all absolute garbage and you hate it and you don't want to even see me play it? People seem to like the first God of War, right? It's good. It's good. It's good. The first three are all good. Worth it? Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, general consensus is is that the game is still is still pretty good. I mean, I just, guys, I just played Dark Souls 2, so. Is it worse than Dark Souls 2? I'm kidding. doing i'm having such a uh, such trouble with the rings first three god of war games in a nutshell Zeus! if you can handle that it's slightly dated it's worth playing is this pure black world tendency is there is there a, a a demon soul here? A colorless demon soul? You'll have mozzarella sticks and garlic bread as a side. All right. Boy. Boy. Diet Co They don't have soda. They don't do the soda. Yeah, they like they you could buy you could buy a, a two liter of it for like six bucks. It's and it's a, it's Pepsi, I think. You never see that black phantom spawn on the hill. I've died here a bunch of times. So it's, it's either black or pure black tendency. That's why it's there. The end of the next area before the shanty town. So where is it? Like from where I'm looking right now, where? Jesus. <laughs> By the second ramp? I hope this is, I hope this is the right tendency. Because these things are vile, and I love them. I freaking love them.
No, that's bad. Oh, that is bad. Oh, I see the demon though. I see, I see the demon. Oh, he stopped chasing me, thankfully. Frack, man. Look at this thing, dude. It's like a big giant tick or something. Look at it. All right. I guess it was worth dying here a bunch of times. Those things are disgusting. Uh, it's genuinely one of the most disgusting things in a video game. Genuinely. You love killing them? All right, hold on. Let me uh, order uh, Hera and I some food here. Just give me a minute, guys. Mozzarella sticks. Add to cart. Why is my computer run chugging so slow right now? Add to cart. The bread of the garlic. You don't want anything? What do you mean you don't want anything? So they don't have Diet Coke, so you don't want food. Okay. Mountain Dew is better than Coke. Bro, Mountain Dew rots your teeth. All pop rot your teeth? No, Mountain Dew is worse. Like it's 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 well documented. It it's much worse at it. Did I go the wrong place? Please don't get poisoned. All right, no, we're okay. We're okay. God damn, this place is a nightmare.
What is hitting me? You know, it was probably a real good thing to uh, heal there. I didn't realize my health was so low. So you really don't want food? You'll take her food? I, listen, I, I don't understand. You, I don't know. I, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say anything. I don't understand though. Hey, Vile, how's it going, dude? Literally just downloaded Demon Souls for the first time. Should I leave so I can experience it? Yeah. Go, go play it, man. Slayer of Demons. Kill her before him? Dude, you're gonna get me killed trying to do that. You will not turn back, will you? No. I shall no harm come to dearest destroyer. Yeah, catch me if you can, you stupid dumbass! I'm plagued. Oh, I can't do it. Oh no, he's coming! Oh, he's coming! Frack! Frack! She did Oh my god. Why did you have me do that? And hope to the death. God damn you. Hinoji with the 14 month resubscription. Thanks, Hinoji. They want you to lose all your souls. Souls don't really matter at this point. You can, sh you, dude, he was sprinting through that. It's an achievement. I mean, I don't know if I can get it with. May like, maybe that's something I should do with the Dragon Bone Smasher. I feel like I don't have enough damage to to do this. I mean, we could try, we could try kiting. I can't even, I can't even do anything here. I can't, I can't roll or anything. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. Yeah, I'm not doing this. <laughs> uh. 
I'll try it one more time. There, there, there's, one, there's one way I could maybe try to do it, but, like, I gotta be perfect. Oh, I was not perfect there. Kaylee with the 11 month resubscription. Thanks, Kaylee. I mean, what's what's the parry timing for this? Oh, he can't be parried. All right, then. Yeah, nice. What? What? Oh, oh no, dude. Oh my god. He can be parried if he's one-handing the weapon. I guess he just bonked. Well, this is not really a, an engaging boss fight. I'm just not getting it. Why am I not getting this? Try it later, I guess? I don't... Yeah, okay, it's a little later. Oh, damn, I am out of healing. Frack you, man. He just got me. Oh, he got me again. I I'm gonna heal because if he hits me. No! No 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 what's that do? No!
The pain is real. Unbelievable, man. Just unbelievable. Where's he even go? Where is he going now? What is he doing? What is going on here? What is... Um... This guy's insane. Really? Okay. Bad timing, Zeus. Bad timing. You just gotta be super careful. It's not that hard. You just have to not be stupid. It's like a turn-based game. It really is, right? I'm just glad I did it. I'm just glad I got that done. That was rough. All right. So, oh, I have all this stuff to use. So, yeah. I guess I could get oh actually did I screw up because I gotta I want to level up this one more time I hope I have enough hey Orethian how's it going dude I just I'm just gonna level up my weapon one more time you hate turn-based except Pokemon I hate turn-based in every game I think it's boring as hell All right, we got a plus three. You hate FFX? I mean, I love that game, but I don't know if I'd be able to play it again because of the turn base. They, they should remake that with, with modern combat. That would be good. 
Okay, so that's done. That's done. That's done. We just have this one to do. The FF7 remake was pretty good. No, they only remade like a tenth of that game. So when they when they get off their lazy asses and finish it, maybe I'll play it. I'm not playing one tenth of one video game. And I'm not and I'm not buying I'm not buying one tenth of one video game uh, ten times for full price either. I'll bu I'll buy it when the whole game is released and on sale. Still in about 10, 15 years. Just play the original, but it's turn-based? No, I don't want to do that. <laughs> Skyrim sometimes feels turn-based. This is Skyrim combat right here. It's almost like RuneScape. Get into it myself. Go on, have a look. They're more riches than I've ever dreamed of. That's it. That bit just there. Go on, get a little closer. Kill him? Why? He seems nice. Wait, wait for what? No, what's gonna happen? Oh my god! Starving to death, then I'll sell every last trinket off your corpse. <laughs> <laughs> What's your name? Evans, did you fall for that little devil's trap? Oh, it's that Mike kid from Stranger now Things. Now we know what happens to him in the next season. Spoiler alert. A fearsome dark phantom stands between us and freedom. But have no fear. God will cleanse us of evil. Pray Good old God. Us. Good old God. Oh, Jabroni Jones over here. Dual wielding like a badass. Oh! <gasps> Got him. Give me my stone of ephemeral eyes, baby. Is this Saint Urbane? Oh, did you cleanse the world of the aforementioned phantom? God has chosen you. Umbasa. Umbasa. God has chosen Umbasa. Umbasa. Good old God choosing me for his business. Abdallah Almula with the eight month resubscription. The Twitch Prime resubscription, no less. Thank you so much. Did Gascoigne. Yeah, Umbasa was in, in Bloodborne. They took it out, though. You! You! got to make a living, right? Here, look. I can make up for it. There aren't many humans like us. We need to stick together. Yeah. Have this as a token of my friendship. <laughs> a gash resistance ring? <laughs> Come on. Let's be friends. 
What do you say? No All right, do, do, we, do we kill him or not? Do we hit the kill button? Or do we let him live? Kill, kill, kill. Got him. I'm pretty sure this sword has a, uh, it's like a show tell. It goes through shields because I was just able to cut him out. So did we just patch him out of oh. oh my god. Oh my god. The jokes today. They're amazing. That's an ad. Where is hold on. There's like a way down here. Where's the way? There's like a super secret way down. I think it's, I think it's like over here, right? Or something? Maybe they patched it out? I don't know. I'm not gonna risk it. It seems like there's a death box or something. I, I could just smell it in the air. And he just dies there? <laughs> That's actually really funny. Even oh, there is a death box there? I, I smelt it, I told you. <laughs> Love this game. Later, nerds. Oh, my order is approaching. Food time soon. I love... This is one of my favorite spots in the game. It just... It's so cool. Slugs and the mist. You find the sticky white stuff here. It just, it's such a little, it's, it's a little area, but I've always loved it. All right, before I uh, do this boss, I'm just going to run to the bathroom. I'll be right back, guys.
All right, thanks for waiting around, guys. Let's do this. This place is sick looking, too. The run back is brutal if you die, though. Bro, I I beat L uh, Latria 3-2, and the gargoyles took me up, and I immediately fell off of the, the tower and had to go back through 3-2 all over again. Hey, dude, I was getting some food. What are you doing? What a dope intro. Yeah, this boss is sick. Obviously, a little limited on attack because it's a PS3 game, but man, is it good. Oh no. Almost died. <laughs> nice little spin move there. Oh, I saw up his skirt. Booty slap. Booty slap. Mallow with the 12 month Twitch Prime resubscription. Enjoy your golden aura. Enjoy your big black Z because you have ascended. Thanks for the whole year of support, you absolute legend. Frat shot. Oh, I'm dead. I p good thing I pushed the beam back. Almost, I literally almost died at the end there. Literally almost died. That was close. You love how the Moonlight Sword just lights people up like it's Christmas? It's- they did a great job with it. They really did. Turn your music up for this fight.
That's the second sword we've put pulled out of the ground on this playthrough. <laughs> Whiff. The big fish is coming in. Chicken Parmesan buff. It's a flying whale, it's a mana ray. <laughs> Miss that booty. One more, one more pass. Cloudstone. We are playing Final Fantasy VII. Oh, Jesus Christ! Bot. All right, one more pass. <laughs> It's coming in. Oh, shit. Almost fell on me. Today you started saving to build a 2K PC setup. So excited. Never played on PC or used a keyboard to play. Okay, I'm going to give you a big tip. If you're going to play shooters, put your mouse to 400 DPI. Get a big mouse pad and learn how to play that way. Don't increase your DPI. Do it the right way. It'll take some getting used to, but since it's brand new for you... It'll take just as much time, and you will be better at, at shooting games if you like to play them. I'll give you that tip. It's a good tip. 400 DPI. Without the touch, soul of the mind, key to life's ether. 
soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. Art thou finished, Mayday? All right, last levels. You're gonna make a chicken salad sandwich? Enjoy. That's kind of what I felt like today, but I had none. We're having dollar ramen and spam because we're broke. Been there, man. Except for us, it was uh, spaghetti with tomato sauce. Because I found, like, you can get, you can get a can of tomatoes for like a buck. You can get, you can get a, a, a thing of pasta for a dollar. And you get, you get a, a, over a pound of food for two bucks. Maybe you get an onion and some garlic and whatnot. Rice and beans, another go-to. Yep. We ate, we ate we ate spaghetti and tomato sauce for a long time. This weapon just brutalizes these these poor little nerds. What's your opinion about Millennia? Good boss, but has a really stupid attack that has a really stupid way of dodging it. I didn't realize there was still a guy there. <laughs> Is tomato sauce better than pesto or Alfredo to you? Yeah, pesto, like, I like pesto, but pesto is probably my like least favorite Italian thing. Still like it. Alfredo is much too heavy for me usually. Like I'll I'll eat it every now and then, but game too dark. Uh, your monitor sucks. It is not too dark. <laughs> pesto chicken pasta is delicious. Yeah, I I like I like pesto with chicken. It's traditionally served with, like, green beans and potatoes. Alfredo, you gotta be in the mood for it. Yeah, it's like, I don't know. Alfredo's... It's like an Italian-American thing. Doesn't really exist over in Italy. You make homemade Alfredo all the time? I know Hera likes it. Maybe I'll try making it one time. Wow.
I didn't fall off. That's what counts. I did not fall off. was fly as hell. I've never quite done it like that. Ooh. Big Mama Joe Jackson. God damn it. Is an Alfredo just cheese sauce? Just cheese sauce. It's more like a, a cheese and cream sauce. You're totally sick of pasta Alfredo? You've had it too much? You can tell everyone in chat is getting hungry. <laughs> Heavy butter too? Yeah, it's not healthy. Not at all. Yeah, the sword does have a, f oh, a, s a really long reach. It does. Those stuns are absurd. Not really, man. He's got a longer weapon than me. And he's just charging at me with it. Yo, Germany's greatest guy. With the KO Ken times 15 gifted subscription. Hitting me with an insane sub cannon. Straight to the solar plexus, you goddamn legendary air. Thanks for the 15 gifted subs. Everybody at Germany's Greatest Guy, give them a Jesus suck, please. Non-stop suckages. Can't thank you enough for that. Thank you. This, this bite is for you. Mmm. That was a good bite. What a kind person. There, there's a lot of really kind people. Ah! 
Thanks again, Germany. Oh, you're not so tough when you got, you're facing someone with a shield, huh? Love the sucking emo. It's a good one, isn't it? Cinder the beardy. With the 20 month resubscription. Thanks, Cinder. Thanks so much. Down to the wire. Farmer Fang with the 28 month resubscription. Thanks, Farmer. It's funny how slow he looks compared to future versions of the boss in other games. Well, there's no future version of Penetrator, but other all the other bosses are um, you know, much faster. The bosses in this game are slow paced. Pursuer? Um, yeah, I mean, Pursuer is not Penetrator. It's nothing like Penetrator. You ever killed the blue dragon coming up? Yeah, I, th I think so with arrows. Not, not in the remake though. Not in the remake. You're having spicy chicken tenders.
In the original version, killing the dragon is a trophy? Yeah, I, I had to have done it then. Because I do have that trophy. Later, nerd! Poldacat with the brand new Twitch Prime subscription. Welcome in, Poldacat. Thanks for the brand new sub. I stole, I stole Mitch's music. Mitch, why did your music run out? Play it again, dude. Guys, this is actually Mitch P, 1983 on the guitar. Guitar legends. Nickelback part-time guitarist.
A Souls game with like smooth jazz like this might actually be pretty good. Oh, I love when music has like little little dialogues in it. Sounds like a Gran Turismo game. Makes me really happy as a Brazilian to know you guys like this song. Hey, good music is good music. Doesn't matter where it comes from. And once again, perfectly timed. Perfectly timed. Just blood god thing. Titan Hark! I haven't heard this in a Brazilian years. when you turn the music off you really hear some some new sounds huh i didn't know that I love how it has, I love how it has, uh, like a, like a raptors from Dra Jurassic Park's little, little purring noise. Ha! My bad. Sorry. demon souls or as the monumental blinded you whatever your choice you are our first visitor surely you have seen for yourself the pain and suffering that fills this world the dawn is possible so created the old one a poison to poison the old one will feed upon our souls and put an end to this tragedy. Yeah! He is real animated there. You fool. Don't you understand? <laughs> 
no one wishes to go on. Whew! I think he gave me some allergies. Bless me. Yes. Bless me. Thy work is done. Slayer of demons, go back above. The Nexus shall imprison thee no longer. So should I kill her or leave her alive? I think I'm gonna leave her this time. I, I haven't, I haven't, I, I normally stomp on her face. I shall lull the old one back to slumber. Kill, stomp, kill, stomp, kill, stomp. The old one and I shall slumber evermore. Wait, you can't leave me for the old one, you filthy wench. You will be with me or you will be with no one. The old one senses a new and powerful demon by its side. And before long, the world will be engulfed by the deep fog. Bring more souls. She's evil like the doll? She's actually not. She really isn't. The monumental is evil in this game. The doll is evil in this game. But not the maiden. The maiden isn't evil. Yo, look at that. Dak Babcock. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice job, Dak. Dak Babcock! Dak Babcock, he's like a, he's like a, he's like a Martian from Mars Attacks. Dak, Dak Babcock, Dak, Dak, Dak Babcock, Dak Babcock.